Okay, to set up a Google Classroom, it's fairly simple. So what you're going to do first is go to classroom.google.com. And so you should, if you're not already logged in, you're just going to log in first.last at ecisd.school and then um, use your ECISD login. Once you get to this screen, what you want to do is in this top right hand corner, click the plus sign and you're going to create a class. Um, the big one that you want to do is the name, the class name. Um, so however you want to set it up. Um, so I could do, you know, Bartlett Elar Spring 2020 or something like that. Um, this stuff isn't necessarily as important um, unless you need something um, to differentiate from other classes that you create. So then I'm going to click create here. And it'll take a second to create the class. Okay, so now that you're in here, um, your class code will always be visible right here. So right underneath your class name is your class code. And this is what you can give out to students um, for them to join the class. So they would go um, the same place, only instead whenever they click the plus sign, they're going to click join class instead of create class. But considering the circumstances and everything that's going on right now, um, it's going to be hard to kind of get that going. So what I would recommend is that you click the people tab right here and then you click the invite students, this, this little person with the plus sign right there. And then you can type, they're, they're always going to be ID number at ecisd.school, but you can type in um, their name as well, right? And so it has all of this. So this is gonna show me all of the teachers and everything, but if you, for you, you'll type in their name or their ID number. Um, and so see, there we go, right here. If you start typing in ID numbers, there you go. Um, and so you would just click the student and then you would click invite. And then when they go to classroom.google.com, it'll say you have been invited to join, you know, Bartlett Elar Spring 2020. And all they've got to do then is just click join rather than having to go around and do the class code. So this seems like it might be um, probably the easier way to go about that. And that's how you create a Google Classroom. Once you get your Google Classroom created and you start working on content, if you need help with that, please reach out to myself or um, to your instructional technology specialist that services your campus. If you're not sure who that is, um, reach out to me. Let me know. If it's not me, then I'll point you in the right direction. Um, thank you guys very much.